Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum students. How are you all? As you know that we are learning about parts of speech and this is uh, today we are going to learn about adverb. As you know that we have studied earlier about verbs and adverb you can understand from this word ad and verb that it is the combination of two words ad verb. So we can quite uh, easily understand the meaning of adverb. Adverb is a word that adds meaning to a verb and uh, an adjective or an other adverb. So we can say that adverb modifies verbs or it uh, uh, qualifies the meanings of verb, an adjective or an other adverbs. Some uh, students uh, now look here some examples of adverbs are given here the number one is she was walking slowly so you can uh, uh, how she was walking she was walking slowly you are a very clever boy what a type of boy you are you are very clever she was walking quite slowly now slowly is also adverb here and quite is also uh, adding some meaning to an other adverb so uh, these are different examples so we can say that adverbs are of different kinds and the three major kinds are there adverb of manner adverb of place adverb of time students uh, adverb of manners are uh, answer the question how or in what manner like uh, they fought bravely how they fought they fought bravely do not walk so soft how you should not walk so soft so uh, the uh, uh, adverbs which give the answer of the question how or in what manner we call that adverbs adverb of manner look here the second one is uh, uh, adverb of place adverb of place answer the question where look at the examples they followed her everywhere where they followed her everywhere another example can be i have logged for akhtar everywhere i have looked for akhtar akhtar everywhere so this is uh, where uh, I, I have looked uh, for uh, uh, akhtar everywhere so uh, the next one is adverb of time adverb of time answers the question when sana arrived early when sana arrived early so this is the different kinds uh, of examples also given here so uh, these examples are also called the adverb of time that when will you learn to do it uh, it's giving the answer when is also here the book was not available then uh, uh, when was the book not available uh, then so these are the words giving the answer of the question when students some other type of adverbs are also used like adverb of frequency adverb of degree or adverb of affirmation or negation so uh, this is very important that uh, adverb of frequency uh, answers the question how often that how often the work has done daud is always late how often he is late always so always is adverb of frequency adverb of degree answer the question how much or to what extent the meal was almost over to what extent the meal was over almost over so almost is the word uh, which is used as adverb of degree bahadur is very naughty how much he is naughty very naughty so this is also the example of adverb of degree adverb of affirmation or negation say or emphasize that something is true or untrue people are not stupid so not is a word which is used here as a adverb of negation I never eat junk food, never is used here as a verb of negation. 
so students uh, i have discussed uh, some important kinds of adverbs here and you can learn these adverbs very easily now i will give you some examples uh, or some methodologies of forming that these adverbs okay students now let me let, uh, tell you that how you can form different adverbs adverbs especially adverbs of manners are often formed by adding ly to adjectives like polite politely quick quickly foolish foolishly so uh, we add ly after adjectives and we can make adverb of manner when the adjective ends in y preceded by a consonant it is changed to ily like merry merrily ready readily heavy heavily so students one other formation i will let you know that when the adjective ends in l the l is doubled and changed to double l y like cruel cruelly beautiful beautifully okay students some adjectives to adverbs are transformation is like true truly single singly so we just uh, cut down e at the end of the adjective some words can be used either as adjectives or adverbs without any change uh, the examples of these one are uh, the, that one are like fast uh, and hard or late the this type of words are used both as an adjective and adverb okay students uh, another information which is uh, very much important and i would like to share with you that all words that end in ly are not adverbs for example friendly lovely lonely these all are adjectives not adverbs so you should be very much careful while you are using uh, the adverbs or when you are going to identify the adverbs in any sentence so you should uh, uh, get a, a good recognition of that according to the sentence that if they these words are modifying the verbs adjectives or and other adverbs then they will be adverbs otherwise maybe that words are used as adjectives so i hope so that uh, adverbs are quite clear to you and you uh, can recognize these adverbs uh, in a sentence quite easily so students take care of yourself allah hafiz